and welcome to China. Here we are for the RBX Championship Round 3 and this is Chastity 42 for Chastity Racing TV. And what a race we have here. We're just sitting in the in the garage waiting to get out there, having a look at the uh, strategy, see what we're going to do. We'll just bring up the uh, qualifying results up on your screen right now. As we see, Dubsy takes pole, his first pole of the uh, well, his RB, RB uh, career. So yeah, well done to him. Fantastic lap. Only just behind him was Jack of Potato, with me in third place right behind him. And now we head back to the garage so we can head out onto the track for the start of this race. So yep, staying from third. Not really particularly looking forward to this race. I do struggle a little bit at this track and I don't really like the track too much as well. So it's not really a good combination. But we'll see how we go. Yeah, so Dubsy in front there. Well done for him. Fantastic qualifying light from him. Me in third and my teammate Shervo in sixth place. Looking pretty good for Red Bull at the moment. All in the top half of the field. And now the first light, the second light, the third, the fourth. The tension's building. The fifth light. And we're off. And that's a horrible start from me. Can't get any traction in the rear end as we head off down from the line into the first corner kid buys gets flying past us he goes up on spot now you go down as we try and crawl around the outside of him here not too much space on the second we'll see what and there's absolutely no space whatsoever somehow we don't make any contact as my car just slides around all over the place i make a miss shift and kid buys gets gets in front of me there well done for him from the start it's kid buys and jack of potato contact and jack of potato has gone off and he'll drop down a few positions. That is absolutely incredible stuff we're seeing right in front of me. So we have a look at Kid Buys and we decide that lap two, it's a bit too early to making any bold moves into turn one. As we go, as we go wide at the end of the lap, and I fly off and I go into the gravel and I lose heaps of time. This is absolutely horrible. No grip, can't get any traction down the car, it's just sliding everywhere. I'm trying to find the right gear that will give me the grip and will get me out as fast as I can as we go into the next last corner and Jack of Potato comes across me and there's really nothing I could do there even though there was no contact there was definitely a lag bubble there as we're watching more lag from Mighty Murph with the DRS open trying to get past him he's on the slower tyre and it's definitely super important we get past as he just doesn't give us much room at all as he breaks really late but we get past him and that's fine we go into the pits already on lap four these tires are shot all that driving all the uh, passing and the uh, going off it's really hurt the tires there's a two sorry a three a three second point two pit stop there we follow in duck on lap seven and uh, that looks like he's struggling so we we'll use a bit of curse, see if I can get past him down into this corner. And I break later than he does and make the apex and get it done pretty smooth there. That's probably the best move I probably make for the entire race. Everything else is pretty shocking, really. A Shervo Jones in front. My teammate, don't want to knock him out, but he's on the slower, he's on slower, older tyres, so we've got to get the job done at some point. The Shervo gets hit by Jack of Potato, I think that was, looking at the. Uh, Time is great. Paint Boy moves across as I try to have a look at him. Nearly lose it. Very dangerous driving there. From probably a bit of both of us, really. As Paint Boy drives off the circuit and he'll lose a lot of speed on the exit. And I'll take the DRS and go past him. Probably the safest pass there possible. Down the straight. Lap 11 we're on at the moment. And I'm back up into second place with pit stops. Third place, fourth place now on lap 13. Okay, Switching for the prime tyres. Another 3.2 seconds pit stop. Very consistent this team. As Jack and Tedis the fastest lap and we rejoin on lap 14. Paint Boy right behind me. Now lap 21 and we're pitting again. third stop, the third and final stop for this race. And we leave the box in fifth place at the moment on lap 22. Jack of the Tato ahead. 
and Shervo Jones has dropped back dramatically as we try and have a look and I get down underneath him even though I didn't really want to at that point in time and I think I push him a little bit wide there so I'm sorry for that but I really wasn't expecting you to go so slow and wide through that corner and that'll round off the end of the race as we come around the last corner in fourth position down one spot from qualifying despite everything I think that wasn't too bad a race in comparison to what it could have been dropped back into I think about seventh place after that off on turn two sorry on lap two and uh, fought my way through, got back into fourth place. Some decent points, and I still retain the championship lead. So that'll probably do me for this track, which I didn't particularly like in the first place. Thanks for watching, everyone. If you like this video, please leave a like. And if you want to see more racing videos, please subscribe to my channel. As we have a look at Dubsy on top step for his first win in the RB season. Well done for him. Absolutely awesome qualifying from you so uh, well done definitely deserved and I'll see you all next week at Bahrain goodbye well, I just